All right, gang, SHOT Show 2016. I'm here at the Surefire booth. They always have something new and exciting. I got Andrew, who's going to take us through some of the high points of this show. Thank you very Thank much, you, Larry. Appreciate you stopping by. Thank you, brother. Take so, it away. Bunch of new stuff for 2016. Start off some of the new exciting keychain light. This is the Sidekick. So it's a polymer construction, lithium ion rechargeable battery. Top button right here for activation, three levels, five lumens, 60 and 300. Micro USB rechargeable. This is an Amazon exclusive currently. It'll be available to all our dealers shortly, $80. Okay. IntelliBeam. So last year we, we uh, debuted an IntelliBeam handheld light. It's an auto adjusting light based on a sensor in the bezel. We've incorporated it into a few new flashlights, one of them being the Scout light. Pretty awesome if you go into a short room, instead of having all that output bouncing back into your face, if it's a white wall, this will dial down to a minimum of 200 lumens. We set the baseline at that 200 lumen level, so if you come around a corner and a bad guy, you at least have enough light to you know, disorient him and for you to make a good decision. And uh, it'll dial back up to 600 lumens if it's enough light not reflecting into the bezel. So for a long shot, you still have the capability of more output. New 9 suppressor, last year we did the Rider 9 tie. This is the, the same concept with the titanium construction, but this is the nine modular. So the front two baffles you can remove to make a shorter overall length. Just gives you more option. Might be switching this between you know a nine millimeter carbine and the pistol itself. On a carbine with that longer barrel length, uh, you can get away with removing those two baffles as far as sound suppression goes. It'll still be hearing safe. Even on a full-size handgun, you're right at that threshold for hearing safe. So depending on what you uh, want to do with the gun, if shorter overall length is your goal, you can go that way. You just uh, unscrew this and then put the end cap back on that, that uh, shorter section. Also might want to mention, this is the uh, Duke Defense RBU. So basically it takes the uh, stock block dovetail for the rear sight, but it also uh, gives you the capability for mounting an RMR, and then there's built-in irons. So, yeah, so pretty, you have irons already in the field of view. Correct. So step over to the fire pack. This is what the most, most of the buzz has been about. This is brand new for SHOT Show 2016. Basically what this is is a 1500 lumen flashlight as well as a lithium ion battery pack that you can recharge your cell phone with. So it comes with, uh, or actually you have to purchase separately the Surefire phone case, which has a dovetail system so you can attach it to the phone. And then there's a Bluetooth app that you can control the output of the light with. So there's five different settings all the way up to 1500 lumens, which of course is a, a, a lot of light for this little package. Um, the advantage of course is, you know, a lot of people nowadays travel with a lithium ion battery pack, so you can have, you know, your, your phone's your lifeline, so you can get a little bit more life out of it. If you're already gonna carry that, you might as well have the added capability yeah, of a flashlight, sure. whether it's for emergency situations, or maybe if you're a blogger or you're a big on Instagram, you, now you have the added capability for, you know, nighttime low light filming and, and pictures. Cool. Lastly, wanted to touch on the Warcom. Um, this is the, basically it's one of our SF3P flash hiders that's been ported. What it does is reduces your muzzle rise so you can, you know, stay on target. Doesn't do much for recoil reduction, but mainly the muzzle rise is what people are concerned about. Still retains 99% of the flash hiding capability, so it's really, really no flash at all at night. Now, is it just a flash or basically a combination device only, or can you interface it to the Surefire suppressors at this time? It works with the SOCOM suppressors, so SOCOM 1, SOCOM RC2 suppressors, all of them will integrate with that work on. Yeah, I'll have to get some of those. You definitely do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, dude, thanks a million. I appreciate Always you Always enjoy by. coming by to see you guys. Yep. Long history with Surefire. Definitely. No, we appreciate the love. Hey, thank you, bro. Enjoy it. Have a good one.